Hey guys, I'm back and uh, I have to tell you something. Nine balls are this. Yeah, it's my costume. My jacket. I'm not gonna use that because we were gonna get like chaps that are like right here. Belt and this belt and this van brace and everything. And just make it all and this over right here. All that and make it, but instead we just bought it. And it, it didn't come with the hood, so we called them. We have to get that fixed. I'm sorry that the video's up and down, but I've had a hard day and just too tired to redo it. It's, there's no um, costume that comes in a kid's size, so it's bigger on me. Probably just gonna um, sew these like downwards, and then whenever I get bigger, I can unsew it and sew them more. And I'm gonna have to make more holes for this belt, so I can make it like up here, down here. Every, everything else is fine. I think the best part about this costume is probably this right here. Just can't get over it. It's so awesome. And there's like a little piece right here, like like a little like a little kitchen knife, like a little butter knife. And like put the handle right, like put it right there, so you can like take your fingers. Sing. But I actually have to tell you something. I had an idea for a hidden blade if you don't want like a mechanism one. Like if you're out hunting, you can have like a string on your finger. And there's like, you have to pull it like that and like you can do that and it won't come out. But you have to do, you have to grab the string and pull it. But the sheath is on your arm and it's, and it's like the handle of the drill has a, has a drilled hole in it and you tied it. And whenever you pull it, it flings out, you can grab it and use it. It's really good idea. Yeah. Also, I have these, but they're it's not as good because like it would have been easier if they were separate. Like we could have put that on, and the shirt. It's part of it. At least it's easier to. It's harder to put it on. Well, it would have been hard because these buttons. But they're pretty good. I think I'm the first on YouTube to ever review this. I think I'm the first one on YouTube to ever get one of these. But <clears throat> it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I have to, I, I like it. Also, I like how it came with the chaps to tie them on, but if y'all get this tip, you don't tie them around, you tie them to your belt loops. Right there, I'm sorry, these pants aren't too good. But you tie them to your belt loops, or these will just fall. But see this? It's not falling because it's tied up. Oh, and these aren't on wrong, you just gotta flap, put the flaps down. Put the flaps down. There. There we go. <clears throat> And this belt, so you make the stuff out of rubber so you're not like running and then all of a sudden, I hurt to sue you. And this, also rubber. If you're like plastic or something, it would be not more fun. And this belt, Velcro, on here. Sash. This part of the belt. I just wanted to talk more, but I can't not look at the video. Oh, also these flaps. Just flaps. Not really pockets. And the inside of the costume is pretty pretty good. Pretty comfy. It's like normal costume stuff you'd feel. Oh, the inside of this is actually pretty neat. It's like a hardest fluffy type of thing. It's not fat, it's fluffy. And this glove is a glove, not, not part of the wrist. Very small fingered, big wrist glove. That's what I like about it because then you can go in pretty deep so you're not running and all of a sudden you put your hand up and it doesn't pop out. You can it'll stay in. It has the van brace right here. Has the shoulder pieces. Pretty good. Well, that's it for now. But if you get this and you're like my size, I'm like, I'm like five. 
five nine or something, but you gotta um put more holes in it or this will go down and this will like fly everywhere. Either that or you just don't want it to look like a noob. See that? Okay. Burr burr.